Well, would you believe I'm here with Barbie Komazek. How are you, Barbie? Oh, great. Thank you, Shane. Oh, I have known this lady for 600 years. She never ages. She's amazing. One of the premier dance teachers here in Adelaide. And, of course, tonight, super excited because her daughter, Nadia, is playing Columbia. I know. I'm so excited to oh. see her. <laughs> What a great role. And I was looking at her the other day and she was talking about you and I thought, she does her mum proud. She definitely does her mum proud, for sure. And she was for talking sure. about the tap dancing and I said, now, I bet your mum's, you know, giving you any comments, feedback, make sure the, you know, the double wings are right or whatever, the triple wing or whatever it is. Double wing, yeah. No, <laughs> I haven't given her any notes because she's perfect, so uh, she doesn't need any. And you're any. sitting up nice and close so that you can yes, take it all in. I'm in G. So I'm really looking forward to Now, your daughters are amazing because not only is Nadia here in the Rocky Horror Show, we've got Zoe in Mamma Mia. Yes. Amazing. I know. And they were both in Matilda. I know. Together. I saw them in Matilda. They yes. are amazing. Yep. And isn't it great to see a lot of this homegrown Adelaide Absolutely. talent? Absolutely. Most of whom you've been responsible oh, for no, getting them I'm up very, there. I'm very, very fortunate, very blessed oh, yeah. to have had so many students go on and work professionally. I'm oh, no. just... Less. Well, that's your work. Oh, that's thank your good you. And work. their talent, of yes, course. Yes, I know. Barbie is the Abby Lee Miller of Adelaide, I am. but much nicer. And she's not in jail. She's here with us I right am. now. Well, you have a beautiful thank night, you, Barbie. Shane. It is lovely to see you. It seems unhealthy. I'm here with Carleen. How are you? I'm very well, thank You're you. You're looking pretty amazing there. Thank you. I'm very pumped and excited about tonight. Have you ever seen the show before? I have, about a hundred times. <laughs> <laughs> Big to fans. be exact, yeah, have you? Yeah. Whereabouts have you seen oh, it before? All over. Um, we saw it last time it was here. We see it at the movies. When it comes to the yeah. movies, we watch it at home. We're big fans. So are we going to be seeing you standing up time warping? Oh, yes, I'll be time warping. <laughs> Show sure. us a bit. Uh, <laughs> ah, she's got the move. <laughs> she is doing it. Okay, well, I'm here at the Adelaide Festival Centre with the man himself, Mr. Peter Gers, who has just stepped off stage as the narrator in Rocky Horror. Peter, <laughs> are you still standing? Hello, Sh Barely. You know, wonderful work together we, back oh, in the day. Oh, look, over the years. It was a period, wasn't it? <laughs> yeah, it yeah. was indeed. You and were grey <laughs> then. I turned you grey. Yeah. You've just come off stage from the I Rocky know. Horror Show. You were fantastic. I'm so lucky to be. It's the most wonderful company, Shane, that I think I've ever worked with. I just love them, everybody. Um, Craig McLaughlin is a superstar. Yes, you know he we is. Know a, that. He is fantastic, and he just owns it. I saw him um, 25 years ago, okay. and then again two years ago, and, he, and now now, and I'm watching him from the wings, and he gets better and oh, better and better. Amazing. I said to him. If this were a silent movie, if we came in and made a silent movie, such as your son, you know, makes yes. movies, doesn't he? <laughs> he does. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, uh, Kieran, if uh, if we made a silent movie of what you do in this show, it'd still be funny. Yeah. Because physically, absolutely. he can do a quadruple take. Forget a double take. He yeah. can do quadruple takes. He's magnificent. Then um, and I a lovely guy. Lovely man. Lovely. Yeah. And the whole company is. Uh, see, I came in on. Wednesday, okay, you know, and here, here we are, Sunday, and, <laughs> and they knew what so they were, they they were knew doing. What I was doing, and I didn't have a f idea what I was doing, but they've eased me into it, right? And pros all round, and yes, it's just yeah. been a huge honour. And to step out there uh, and you know say, um, I would like, if I may, <laughs> to take you on a strange journey. It's fantastic. Yeah. Two thousand people. And those iconic well, words, it's just a jump. I, to the left. I could <laughs> die happy. In fact, I may after interviewing this. You know, this is causing me Now, to when die. are anyway. the performances? People well, will want to come and see you. When are you on? You've I'm just on. on I'm on on Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, the 9th, 10th and 11th. Nick. Next week. Yes, but Beautiful. it continues Tuesday to Sunday for the next two weeks. Right. With a wonderful Cameron Daddo, who's 
wonderful in it. Different to me, of course, yep. but wonderful. Yep. And, and and this stunning production. I can't. Uh, it's not just because they're paying their fortune. Um, <laughs> well, that's good to hear that they're paying it. you a fortune. But no, no, no. Look, it, I've, as an audience member, I love this show. Yeah. And and it's been a great privilege to watch it in the wings and to go wow. on with these people, as you well know, kiddo. And what about Nadia Commissaire? Oh, dear little oh, Nadia. How you would have worked she? with I her. I did work yes. with her. Yes, and she was in Gypsy when we did it. What a treat. And trooper. here we are, Adelaide's own. I know. Because her mother, Barbie <laughs> Jane's the best dance teacher in Adelaide. She is yeah. indeed. Well, apparently she opened the theatre so many years ago. She was only 16. What, Barbie Jane? Yeah, Nadia was saying the other day, she must have been one of many on stage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I was here, because now it's reopening. I know. I was here at the very first... 1970... <laughs> <laughs> at the very first um, a, a performance, it was a dress rehearsal to right. check the acoustics and the sound and yeah. like Two one-act operas, long time ago. Wow. What's that, 30... Uh, five years ago, Neil. And is there still the rush when you stepped out there tonight? Oh, absolutely. Was your heart beating? Oh, <laughs> in a good I'd, way? I thought I'd die of nerves all day. <laughs> I came in here to annoy people because I thought I'm sitting at home being nervous. I might as well be in here. Exactly. But I think in Adelaide, people need to come and see this guy, the amazing Peter Kerr. How did you land the gig? Last they question. asked me. They just... <laughs> <laughs> and I, as you know, I never say no. 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 <laughs> And uh, you say no, you miss out on things. Exactly. No, I they never honoured, ask again. I was honoured to be asked, and uh, as I said, and to work for John Frost. Yes. As I oh, said, as Jill legendary. Perryman said when she played Dolly for John Frost, not only is this a part I love and a producer I love, but if he asked me to go out and sell lollies in the interval, <laughs> I'd do it. And so would I. Thank you, Frosty. Oh. Thank you, Adelaide Festival Centre. Thank you, Shane. Well, it only gets better. Guess who I just bumped into? The amazing Mel Berglund. Hello. How are you? Now, you've just been in and see, seen the show. What did you think? I have. I was blown away. I've, I'm such a Rocky Horror fanatic. I've seen the movie in excess of 300 times. Oh I'm obsessed with it. Um, and I actually had never seen the stage show, but it was amazing. Rob Mallett was incredible. Hi, Rob. Um, it was, yeah, the whole cast were incredible. And isn't it great to think, while you're watching all this talent, that here we are in Adelaide, for those of us that are still here, you're in LA now. I am, yes. Oh my God, tell us about that. Uh, I've been there just shy of two years and it's it's challenging but it's fun and it is sunny every day. And um, Great weather. It's great weather. You, you can never complain about the weather. No. But it's so funny because every second person that you meet is an actor too. And yeah. so you can't escape the industry. The industry is everywhere. And you get in an Uber and they say, oh, you're an actor. Here's a screenplay I wrote. And like everyone's just trying to get into the bit. As so. you do. I'm here with the most amazing Laura and Tony Artsy from Fresh. How are you going? I'm good, Shane. How so are you doing? I'm good. You're a Rocky Horror diehard. Oh, my gosh. Especially with Craig McLaughlin. Isn't he fantastic? He is fabulous and a little bit sexy. <laughs> Ladies, are you with me? I think a very <laughs> bit sexy. Oh my god! Yeah. He he cuts that outfit pretty well. Oh I my gosh, you. he rocks the hills. I he rocks him better than me. <laughs> And I rock them pretty well. I doubt that. You <laughs> rock them pretty well. 2018, big year ahead. Ooh, it's going to be a massive year. Lots and I hear, I know we can't say too much, but I hear your star is rising. Oh, it's going to be a good 2018. That, that's Let all me we that. can say. But this lady's star is rising. Amazing in radio. Thank you, thank you. And we'll be hearing maybe more in 2018. Yeah, I'll definitely keep you updated. Okay. And what about local girl Nadia Komazek? Oh, Up there, absolutely. Barbie's daughter. Oh, I know. Barbie, fabulous. fabulous and what about teacher. you? You've got your own dance school. I do. You're celebrating 10 years. 10 year anniversary. Wow, in That's Sydney. In That's you, right. I don't know how you've done it. How many students have you got? We've got um, around 200 students. Oh, my yeah, Lord. Yeah, but they, they're... They, they pretty much move in and live there. They're, they're ones, it's one of As you things. do when you learn dance, <laughs> <Yeah>. you, you, <laughs> there's no secondary measure, is there? That's right. So that's over in Sydney now. Of course, I miss Adelaide, but yes. the school's um, great fun. And, and we missed you. Oh. Choreographer extraordinaire. Aww, Did so it. many Adelaide shows. And here with your beautiful husband. I am. I am. Joel. Joel. He's oh. over there doing his thing. He's actually a performer as well. Hi, Joel. How are you? Oh, he's a performer as yeah, well. He is. Look, it runs in the 
family. <laughs> it's well, so wonderful right. to see you. Now, Me you too. enjoy. I will. I, I and uh, Happy New Year. Thank you, darling. <laughs> Kathy. Well, I'm now here with James and Jenny, and I must say I'm feeling slightly underdressed. You guys look amazing. What do you love about Rocky Horror, James? Uh, the energy yeah. and the excitement behind it. Have you seen the show before? Only in the movie. Okay. Oh, this is your first time? Yeah, this is my first actual show. Wow. I think you're going to actually outshine the cast. I mean... No, I doubt it. They're pretty good. How amazing does he look, Jenny? He, um, amazing. Just... And look at you, do a little twirl. <laughs> wow, what do you love about the show? I mean, the music, the set, everything. What is it? Um, I've grown up watching it. It's the first time for me seeing the actual oh, show wow, again. Great. So, um, yeah, no, just the atmosphere and I guess hey, you can express yourself. And are you guys actually going to stand up, dance and time war? I hope so. The time warp especially, but we'll see how we go for the rest. The shoes are killing me. <laughs> Save for the night. <laughs> or maybe a bite. <laughs> I'll show you my favorite obsession. I've been making a man. He's got blonde hair in a town. He's good for relieving my... <laughs> 